Hello everyone, I'm back today with another video. Um, this is going to be a tournament game against uh, Rozak here. Um, he is a pretty good player, as you can see here. I think he's been over 900 ELO before, like 960 or so. Um, so this is the setup I got. It's something I kind of made on the spot, just because. So we'll see how this works. Um, this game is for the World Team Tournament. This is the second round, but our team, which is USA, got um, a bye the first round. So this is my first game. I'm not really sure how I want to approach this game, because the last game that I had against him, I beat him, but he's beaten me several times before then, so I'm not really sure exactly what to do yet. But I guess we'll find out soon enough. Um, this setup is a little bit interesting, I guess. Uh, it's got a few high bombs, but nothing too crazy, I guess. That might be a captain, but oh well. I think if that was a captain, he would have hit it already, so that's why I moved the captain out. The reason I did that is because I wanted to get my captain to safety and also be able to guard this lieutenant here. So I pulled the captain out here, and then the lieutenant's guarded by the major. Alright, I don't think this piece is really that good, but I'm just going to put a scout up against it and see what happens. Okay, so it is a captain, so it wasn't something spectacular like I thought. Alright, no trading for him, that's fine, I don't really care. I'm just going to retreat because there's no need to lose a captain right now, um, so I'm just going to retreat with that just to be safe. I'm going to leave that captain there though. We know captain here and these three, or these four have moved. Oh, alright, pretty good. I'll take that. That's definitely uh, good, I suppose, because he already knew this captain, so we figured I wouldn't bring another one, but that's a nice pickup. Alright, so I'm going to retreat this piece here. Um, let's see, this is the captain here, but I'm going to bring this colonel up. And then I'm going to move this scout over here. Okay, and then we got that colonel to guard it, so we're not completely bluffing. And I would appreciate it if he comes down and trades at least one of these captains, which he looks like he's about to do, which I would definitely welcome. If we can trade one of these captains off, I'd really appreciate that. <laughs> I'm trying to get him to hit that sergeant. I'm not sure how I feel about this piece here. I guess I'm going to bring this stuff back here, and I want to try to... Okay, I would like to trade this off, um, if he'll let me. I have a feeling that's kind of a bluff, but I really don't know what to do. I feel like that's a bluff. I really do. Um, 
if it was a major or something, he wouldn't just give it to me for free, so I'm going to hit that. Oh, that's unfortunate. Okay, well, hopefully I can pick up this major here. We'll see. Okay, excellent. All right, um, I'll take that. I thought that that was a bluff just simply because um, he just left that sitting there. And unless he thought that this was a trash piece, he would have probably hit it instead if it was a major. I still don't know why he didn't hit it in the first place. Maybe because he was hoping to get the captain and then hit that piece. If he moves this back... Okay, he's not. Um, okay. So this is probably not a good piece. Or it might actually just be a kernel. But there's no way that I'm um, risking it like that. I do like what the graveyards reflect at the moment. So I'd like to keep it that way. Alright, this is probably a totally insignificant piece. Yeah, okay. But we traded that, so that's not bad. It's not like I discovered something trashy. Okay. So, the reason I did that is he's not going to have another major, and if this is a kernel, he won't risk it to hit it. But when he moves this down, I'm going to move that over and scout this piece here. Let's see what that is. Okay, so it's a kernel. So we know Captain and Colonel, and this is moved, and I feel like that's probably moved too, but I don't really know. I'm totally fine with just trading that off here. Um, this is the Captain, so I'll move next to that. But if he retreats further, I don't think I'm going to want to risk going into it like that. He probably thinks that's my general because when his major was here I had it guarding. Okay, and he's going to trade. Now what that makes me think is that there's nothing guarding this captain here. Because otherwise he could have gone into oblivion over here and let me hit that captain. So I'm pretty happy with that. Um... Yeah, I'm, I'm quite happy with that. Um, I do not want to have too many moved pieces here, uh, or known pieces, I mean, so trading off that kernel is good. So now, if we remember, this piece was guarding a lieutenant, so that could be a major. Whereas I know this is the captain, that's probably an insignificant piece. Alright, this is also his captain, by the way. So, we know captain, captain, possibly major. So I would like to trade that if I can. But he doesn't know that this is my major, and he probably doesn't have any reason to suspect it's a major, other than the fact that I'm bringing it up after we exchange kernels. Because usually most players will bring certain pieces up um, that's one level lower than what it was that we just traded off. Because they're thinking, oh, well, we just traded kernels, he's not going to have another kernel in the center. That's what they usually think. Okay, that's another captain, so that's the... Second captain, and that's the third one here, but that's pretty good. Um, I already got a captain for this guy here. I guess this could be possibly a good piece, so he didn't want me to move next to it with, like, a trash piece. If this moves down, I already know three of his captains, I'm going to hit that with a lieutenant. It's probably a scout, I think. And I know that's the captain here, so... That could also be a good piece, but then if I hit it with the lieutenant, then that's kind of fine, because then I'm discovering a good piece with the lieutenant. But I'm pretty sure that's like a scout. Um, it's not the colonel. It's not a colonel or a major. And it's certainly not the captain. So either we trade, or I pick up something, or it's a high piece of, like, one of these two. But at any rate, we know Captain here, and that's moved. 
and nothing else yet. Alright, I'm going to move that miner up. I'm just going to leave that there. I'm trying to make him think that this is my general. I know that's a captain. Unless I've forgotten it, but I, I doubt that. My memory is poor, but I don't think it's necessarily that bad. Let's see what he does here. Nope, okay. Alright, I'm going to hit that. That's probably a scout. Or sergeant. Even better, that's fine. I was tracking that piece, and like I called, it's either one of these down here, or it's nothing good. So I'm good with that. Alright, so he's going to move next to that. He might move... Okay, he will move down into it. Um, I'll do that. I'm not sure if I want to necessarily reveal my colonel, but it would be even better if he moves down, or if he takes this sergeant, and then I'll take that. And then we get some info if he decides he wants to attack the major with this piece. What I would like, definitely, though, is for him to move down here. That would be excellent. That would be another free piece. But I don't think he's going to do that. Alright, I'm just going to take that now, because I think he's trying to skewer this piece. So we'll just take that, and we'll get that out of the way. Now, that might make him think this is my marshal, but... Mm, oh well. Okay, so this is the piece that was hitting the major. Uh, I mean, sorry, that was guarding the captain that I hit his major with. That's for info. Okay, so that's the colonel, like I figured. So that's good to know the second colonel there. Okay, and he will not want to trade. I didn't expect him to want to do that. But, um, I'm going to hit this piece. Marshall. Wow. Okay, that's that's fine info for that. That's fine info. I'm totally good with that. So we've got Marshall, Captain, Colonel. Unknown piece here that may, might be general based on the Marshall. I, I don't know. I don't know. That could just be like a scout, too. Okay, um, okay, here's what I'm going to do, though. I am going to advance here with this major, because he's n this general is not going to be one of these two, I don't think. And we already know the colonel and the marshal, so... Alright, so he's probably just going to retreat with those there. Let's see. Alright, free piece, I'll take it. What do we got? Scout, that's fine. So we picked that up with our Major. Um, let's see, he's got two Scouts left, same as I. I'm up a Sergeant, Lieutenant, and a Captain. And I have an Info Advantage, although he might suspect that's the Marshal. Okay. So this piece is going back there. That might be, like, a major. Maybe. I don't know. That's probably, like, a major. General might be somewhere over here. I don't know. I forget where that marshal came from. I would like it better if I could remember where that marshal came from. But we got colonel here, marshal here, captain here. I'm quite sure that is the captain. Unless I'm forgetting it. But I, I don't think so. Okay, uh, I'm going to go there. Okay, so he's going to waste a scout on that. Um, that's good. That's good. Alright, so we'll go ahead and pull that back. Because that's now, you know, useless. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do that. Trying to encourage uh, trading this captain here if I can. Or maybe getting it with the major. But I would like to get some of these move pieces out of the way. Because I know these four have moved, that's moved, this has moved, and that's moved. Okay, I'm going to offer him this lieutenant because I'm up one. No, he's not going to take it. So that means it's either the general or it's some trash piece here. Okay. Um... Alright, I'm going to leave that there. I'm going to advance with this sergeant. I'm 
Yeah, this is either the general or it's like one of these down here. I would think the general would probably be over here, though. Interesting. That's a risky move. So, um, so I guess he probably thinks that's the marshal. So in that case, um, I'm going to retreat down here. And that hasn't moved. So he might hit that, and he might not. He does know that I like to do high bombs against him. Uh, but, yeah. That hasn't moved. Um, so. Yeah, there's that. But that is a pretty risky play by him, but I think he's trying... He probably thinks it's the marshal. Yeah, he probably thinks it's the marshal. Um, but he probably doesn't want to completely risk it. And while I'm actually not bluffing here, it wouldn't be totally out of the equation to think that I might actually be bluffing. And that that's like a bomb and there's nothing guarding this here. So I'm going to see if I can pick up some info with this sergeant over here. That would be nice if I could find the general. And then I could pretty much force a colonel trade and then alleviate some of this pressure. Alright, he's going to waste his last scout. I am totally good with that. That means next I'm going to advance with this lieutenant. And that lieutenant, he hasn't discovered it, but um, it has moved. But he hasn't discovered that piece yet, so we'll find out. Okay, I'm going to put that right there. And then I'm going to do there to um, make sure he doesn't move down and skewer it. Because he does know the miner, and uh, I'm pretty sure he knows that captain. Um, he might have forgotten it, but... He moved his marshal next to it, so he's not scared of it. Alright, so he's going to move next to that with his captain. I'm going to advance on this captain with my major here. Alright, I'm going to take that just because... Okay, minor. So I'm giving up my captain advantage there, but it keeps that info. Um, but that might think he, that might make him think that that's a bomb. So that's not bad. I am up these three now. So, yeah. And I might lose this lieutenant, but I still have an advantage, I think. But yeah, we got Colonel, something here that I don't know. Okay. Yeah, I was going to say he's not going to trade. I'm not going to move next to that piece yet because it could be the General. I don't think it is, but it possibly could be, and that would be not so great in this situation. So... Okay, I'm going to move back with this. I'm going to move up with that captain. I don't think this is the general. Um, but what I can do is go kamikaze with this major. Maybe get this captain. And if I discover the general, then I can take that and force a trade. And then in that case, I would be down a major, but I'd be up some pretty significant pieces here. Um, okay, I'll take that. Um, we'll see if that's the general. If it is, I also lose lieutenant, but I gain whatever this piece is. So, no, okay. Um, let me just check this piece. Okay, it is, it is. Uh, I must say, I didn't expect that. I didn't expect that. I honestly thought he was bluffing with that. But, okay. Um, let's see here. I forget if, okay, that has moved. Um, yeah, I'd forgotten if that had moved or not. Let's hit this with the lieutenant, because I feel like that's a bomb. Although he might be double bombing it, but whatever. Alright, minor, cool. Um, I'm cool with that. Uh, let's go here, and I'm going to hit that one. Now I do have to be wary of this uh, colonel here. See, we got lieutenant. Alright, 
Cool, we traded that off, and we got a miner out of it, and we took his captain. That is close to ideal. So let's get this guy back here, and we're pretty much getting complete info on him now. He doesn't really know any of my pieces, although he probably suspects all of them, because they're pretty obvious at this point. But we got Colonel... Wait, yeah, that's Colonel. That's the piece I ran away from the Major. That's the bomb, probably. General, Marshal. So you know, Marshal, General... That could be, like, the spy, maybe. I'm not sure. It might not be. The spy's probably, like, over here. But it's not an awful guess, I suppose. Alright, um... Hmm... Uh, let's just go exploring with this sergeant. He may or may not remember it, because he scouted it with this scout here, so I'm sure he probably will remember it. But I think it's worth a shot here. That's the colonel, the general. The only thing I don't like is this major hanging over here. I really don't like that at all. Like, not one bit. Um, but it's not moved, so I kind of hope he doesn't lotto it. But if he does, then I would understand. Um, I would accept that more if he, like, came with a miner, hit that, and then took it. But, I'm up a sergeant, um, so I'm just trying to get some miners or something at this point. I'm also up a captain, so... I don't want to have too many move pieces in this quadrant because there's nothing to guard them. So I know these two are moved. That piece hasn't moved. So these four moved, these two, and these two. And of course the sergeant. And he has these, and then these four. But we know Colonel, he's probably debating whether to hit that. And he decides not to, which I like a lot. Okay, that's the lieutenant. So he didn't remember that sergeant, or he would have taken it, probably. But I think this is a bomb right here. Because just, yeah. Alright, let's go out again with this Major. I'm getting sudden lotto urges to hit that piece, but that's a really unwise decision. But we got General and Colonel, so his piece is over here. Not necessarily in position. Um, but I might just chase this guy around the lakes, whatever. Yeah, I figured we would do this. Okay, so I'm not going to get much done over here, because he's just going to run back to the Colonel. Or we can run around this thing forever. Alright, so this is probably like a sergeant or miner back here. I think there's bomb, bomb, probably another bomb. And then the flag is somewhere here. But I'm pretty certain that right there is a bomb. So let's go ahead and retreat. Um, up two miners and a captain. And I have a huge info advantage. That I'm not really able to uh, take advantage of at the moment. Alright, so we got those pieces moving back to safety. Okay, so we got Colonel, Marshal, General. Colonel, Marshal, General. Worst case scenario, well, not really worst case, but if we trade Marshals, um, then this Colonel would have to get himself out of here. And then he would take the Captain. Um, but I'd still be up three, two Miners or whatever, so that's not horrible. I am not sure what to do right now. I'm really not sure. Um... I mean, I have the advantage, but I don't know how I can take advantage of that. Let's come up here with this miner. I think he's going to hit that uh, major with his um, lieutenant. Yeah, okay, so we're going to have to do something about this here. Alright, um, all right, let's think about this. How can we go about doing this? It would have been better of him to bring his colonel all the way to the right side before doing that, because that gives me a lot less room to work with, but I'm trying to figure out what I can do here. Trying to figure out what I can do here. Now, you might say I should bluff this the marshal like I've been doing, although he probably still believes this the marshal. You might argue I could bluff this the marshal, but if I move this here, then what he can do is take it with his colonel, and if this is indeed the marshal, and I take it, then he can take my colonel. So then that would result in him being up a major, still. Uh, which would be the same as just giving him this for free. So that wouldn't work. Uh, another plan I could do is... Um, I could try to get my general over there, but then that leaves my flag vulnerable. 
um, and he can also discover the spy and marshal quite easily. Um, last thing I could do is maybe move this captain down and do some sort of escape route, but I don't really know. I don't know how I can save that piece. I don't think I can, actually. I don't think I can without causing further damage. I don't think I can save that piece. I don't think I can. So I guess I might as well just um, try to hold on with my leads here. Um, what I'm going to do is move this back, uh, move it back here. And then when he takes it with his colonel, like I said that he would do, he's going to move down, take it, and then if that is my marshal, then he gets a free piece. I'm just going to wait a while and pretend like I'm thinking about it. Because um, there's, there's no way I can save that piece. I just don't think there is. But yeah, when he takes it, I'll just like wait a while, like I'm thinking. I think worst case scenario is he takes that um, captain too, but... Man, I really don't think there's a way I could save that piece. I think that's just an unfortunate scenario, because I was trapped in here. Um, thinking also... Well, yeah, I don't think there's any way to save it. I really don't. Maybe moving the captain and the colonel down, and then bring the marshal over, but... Then it just makes it way too obvious, which is probably already obvious, but... I'm just going to do some exploring over here on this side now. Alright, so he moved that colonel away, which is good, I suppose. Um, that might make him think that this is my marshal, which I, I guess deceiving him is better than nothing. Uh, but his colonel's going to take a while to get over here, but we might as well take these bombs out. Okay. So this is not, you know, anything good over here, but... These, I mean. I'm going to take that out. That's the third bomb, I think. Oh, Captain. Okay. Interesting. So, let's see what he does if I do that. Let's see. We had this piece here and this piece here that were bombs. Um, that could be a third bomb. And then he's probably got a tripod. Alright, so, I'm going to leave that alone is what I mean. Hmm, okay. No, no, not yet. Okay. See what he does. I feel like this is a major. I don't know if doing this is the right idea, but we'll see how he reacts and then we'll figure it out. do that and then I'm gonna move this miner up okay I'll move that miner up then um, he knows it so he probably won't walk his marshal away which is fine um, worst case scenario that's like one of these two but considering he only has one left of each um, they're probably back here so this is probably major Uh, so yeah, if that is a major, um, I don't know. I'm just going to go get this captain, because I really need it. I'm not, I don't know.
he does know this miner, so, um, yeah. If he's thinking about this, then he already knows it. He's probably not thinking about that, because he has a better memory than I do. But, uh, this captain has moved, now all five of these have moved, although they've, well, no, the marshal hasn't, so these four. That could technically still be a bomb, so, you gotta be careful. He has to be careful, too. Yeah, a captain here would make this a lot easier. Whoa, what? Wow. I'll tell him you knew that miner. You scouted it. But that is a marshal right there. And now the only bad thing I can think that would come out of this is if that's a miner. And then he just opens my flag. And he's going to slam right into a major. Well, that was, that was a, a turn of events for sure. Um, wow. Okay. Well, I think I got this game one now. Um, okay, so let's, uh, let's get this spy up here. Let's get this colonel out. He's probably gonna like a lot of everything over here. Which is not necessarily good. Not yet. Okay, well, um, let's, let's see if we can just trade these captains. Okay, you might think this is another bomb. I'll do that. Alright, um... I'm gonna do that, and then I'd like to force him to this side, because that just means less pieces lot of it, I suppose. Let's see which way he goes. I really would like to keep that miner. Okay, I will keep that miner, that's good. Alright, so we're going to be able to manage this lotto here. Um, he's going to be up a minor, but he's going to be down loads of other stuff, like that general. So this game is over now. That was a pretty massive blow-up, um, no pun intended. But overall in the game, that was a pretty... That was really sudden. I don't know why he took that with his marshal. Um, he knew that minor. He'd scouted it, because I had it here, and I had my marshal here, and he scouted it, and I just moved it back. Well, what could have been a really close game ended up being not close at all, but I'm quite happy with that win. Um, got a win for the team. Um, pretty good fashion, too. I think I played quite well. Uh, the major over here was unfortunate, but after all that, I had more than enough to come back from it. So, it was a good game.